What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. So I'm starting this vlog off in my car. Today is Saturday, December 7th, I believe. And I think I'm just gonna do a little weekend. Vlogmas weekend in my life. I'm not doing Vlogmas this year, in case you don't know that. And it's really saddening, like, I don't wanna talk about it because I legit might get emotional. It's 8.22, I'm leaving my house now to go to school because I have to do a ministry for my sociology class and this is my second to last one. I have two more, so I'm gonna do one today and one next week before school ends. Today, we're going to an elderly home and just hanging out with them, having some fun, hopefully staying warm because it is actually pouring outside. Just so fun, such fun things. <laughs> but yeah, it's 8.23. Um, I have to leave in a few minutes, but I just wanted to get out in my car and just get ready. I actually was not planning on vlogging today, like at all, until I just got in my car and I was like, you know what, maybe I should just vlog. <laughs> so here I am, vlogging, didn't plan on it. Here's my outfit of the day. I'm just wearing this hoodie from H&M, um, layered with this jean jacket from Forever 21, I'm wearing my Lulu's and then some checkered fans. I'm not gonna bring my leg up here really quick. Also, Loki struggling so much because I wore my docks the other day for the first time and I was stupid and wore um, ankle socks with them, which was so dumb. Don't know why I did that. The first half of the day, I was like, this is cool. Like, they don't hurt my feet at all. What are people talking about? And then I got the biggest, fattest blister on one of my ankles ever and it's just really painful and I feel really dumb for not wearing crew socks because I definitely should have done that so now I know for the future I really want to wear them right now but I'm not gonna do that because I don't want to be in pain the whole day walking around but yeah I'm gonna leave now I don't really know what else I have planned today but hopefully something fun not sure we shall see I definitely have to come back home after but then I'm going back up to Keiko's tonight because I have to interview his mom for a um little project that I'm doing so all right let's go there's probably gonna be traffic because of the rain so we should probably head out I'll see you guys probably when I get to school hello everyone so we just finished and got back to campus we're done with that it was really fun we just played um, uno flip the whole time played like three games I won around Yes. It's 11.23 now. I'm gonna go pick up Danielle and Janice from their dorm so they don't have to walk in the pouring rain. And then we're gonna go get pho. And I'm so excited because I'm starving and it's just definitely pho weather right now. So I'm excited. But yeah, let's go. Welcome back to the vlog. Welcome back to the vlog. <laughs> I love vlogging. Uh, it's, it's been a minute. It's been a long minute. So I just wanted to do a little Christmas decor haul for you. I didn't get too many things, so I'm thinking I'm not gonna make this into its own video, but I did do a lot of shopping and vlogging while I was shopping, but that is incorporated into some vlogs. So I just did not organize this very well. I went to a few places over the course of many, many days. Today is also December 7th, I believe, which is very late to be decorating my room for Christmas, but I just need to do it now because it's very late and December's almost over. Christmas is almost here, so I'm very late on this and I need to get going. The first place I went to shop was Ross. I didn't get that many things. I was honestly a little disappointed. Um, aside from these, which I'm going to show you right now, I also got like gift bags because they're really cheap and really cute, so I just picked those up while I was there as well. I just got these little um, snowflakes. They're really cute. They just have this like twine rope that you can hang them from and they're like painted little snowflakes and I think I'm gonna put them over there but you guys will see all this. With that, you gotta balance it out and just get a giant one. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't exactly know where I'm gonna put these. That is all I got from Ross. So I also took a trip to Target. I got this yearly calendar. This is the 2020, obviously, calendar. And it's just really cute. It was only $10 and I'm really excited for this. It's not really a Christmas decor, but 
I had to include it because I got it during the process, so. And then I went to TJ Maxx, and I got three things, three of which I'm very excited about. The first one, look how freaking cute this little reindeer is um they had so many like little wooden reindeer type of decor things and this i think was the cutest one don't know why but it's adorable this was 12.99 and it says it's handmade in the philippines so that's really cool it says it's been handcrafted by local artisans of the islands of the philippines now you can celebrate the color and beauty of this lively culture in your own home so cute Next. Did I need more pillows? No. Did I get another one? Of course. This isn't very Christmassy, which is good because then I can use it all year long and I don't have to stuff it away for during the rest of the year. And it says blessed across the front. I actually have a little thing up there that I have had for a long time now. It's literally been upside down this whole time I've been showing you. I think it's cute. And I already washed it and everything and it didn't shrink. Thank God. I thought the pillowcase was going to shrink, but it didn't. So the last thing I got at TJ Maxx, these LED string lights. And these aren't just normal little Christmas lights that you would hang up in your room or on your tree. These are actual legit like mini light bulbs, which I think are so cute. I think I'm going to hang this above my window right here. I think just think that would be really cute. Lastly, I went to World Market. Wait, no. I also went to Home Goods. I'm going to show you what I got at Home Goods first because it's only one thing. So I just got this garland. Well, it's actually ribbon, but I'm going to use it as garland. It's just this little red pom-pom ribbon and it's so cute. I don't know where I'm going to put this exactly. It just looks like this and obviously I can use it to wrap gifts and stuff also. Okay, now I went to World Market. Isn't this so cute? It's a sparkly little like glittery snowy tree. Um, this is a size comparison. Legit the size of my head, but so pretty big, you know? <laughs> But yeah, it just looks like this. It's really pretty and it just looks like a snowy tree and I think this will literally look cute anywhere in my room so I'm not worried about decorating with this because I know it's gonna look very cute. The last thing in this haul is this pine cone garland. It's in a shape, shape of a circle right now but I'm going to take it apart and cut it and I want to put rows like on here. 72 inches. That's like five feet, six feet. This is why I'm not a mathematician. So I did not get a tree because I had one from last year. It's in the shed outside and I kind of want to go explore and go try to find it. So I think that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. Let's go. Okay, so I need to put on some weather appropriate shoes because it is pouring rain outside and I'm wearing my slippers. So, okay. Walmart Burks on. I'm kind of scared to go find this tree because honestly, who the heck knows what is living in my shed. So, let's go. Oh my gosh, it's literally mush out here. This isn't exactly what I was hoping for. <sighs> I'm scared. Why didn't I bring my phone to use the light? Oh my. Okay, I found it. Thank God. My tree! missing a leg so uh yeah <laughs> why didn't i bring my phone okay we're getting out of here it sounded like there was a legit animal in there so i'm running out even though my tree only has one leg but it's okay <laughs> On my tree however we have a problem um i don't think my tree can stand on one leg maybe i'm wrong um i mean this doesn't look like my tree also um i couldn't find the ornaments so my tree is gonna be ornamentless because i'm not about to go buy some your girl is kind of broke right now all right i'm gonna montage the rest of this so let's get to decorating yeah, so honestly, um, I don't know where to put my tree and it's not really standing up on its own. So I'm kind of discouraged about my tree. I might not put up my tree this year, but it's okay. We're going to find alternatives. We're going to find better things to do. All is well. Um, nothing to really be, nothing to really be sad about, you know?
think that worked out pretty well. Let me show you up close because it looks kind of weird from over here. <laughs> Okay, I actually just switched it up a little. I put my little reindeer up there, Christmas tree, and then I moved my snowflake down there. I kept those up there. Don't know what I'm gonna put there, I guess nothing, because I don't know what to put there. And then I tied my little ribbon around my little tree right here, and then put some garland around that one, and then also put ribbon around there, and my tree. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm actually leaving my house right now and I'm going to head to Keikoa's tonight So I'm about to go to the bank to try to deposit my check at an ATM or something Because I really need to do that <laughs> Like really need to do that And then I am going to just stall and go some places before I head up there Like TJ Maxx, probably Target So I honestly freaking love this jacket so much Even though it's very big and puffy and giant but it is so comfortable so soft and i just am so comfy in it so comfy literally i have so many bags all the time i have this one my purse i have to carry my docks and i have my backpack on my back so i'm guessing we're gonna have to take two trips and that's okay <laughs> Okay guys, so I just deposited my check um, and also deposited some cash that I have. Okay, one, I wanted to record it just, you know, for vlog purposes, but at the same time, like, that's kind of smart because sketchy things happen at ATMs at night, especially at night. Well, all the time, but especially at night. So I thought recording it was kind of just a good idea. I mean, I know they have cameras right outside anyways, but like, you know, just, just, just cause, just cause. But I didn't do it for my safety purposes, I just did it. So I can have some montage footage. <laughs> but now I am going to go to, should I go to TJ Maxx or Target? Well, I definitely need to get gas eventually. But I'm right next to TJ Maxx, so I might go to TJ Maxx really quick and then go to Target and then go get gas. TJ Maxx time, baby. Let's hope I don't spend money in here. Let's hope I'm just here to have fun and stall time. <laughs> out for dog sweaters but can't find any all right guys just finished at target all right i just made it to keikoa's and he just just got off work so that was pretty good timing hello come here come here got you a present i got you a present you see it okay oh my gosh <laughs> look for you he's like oh my gosh okay so it's a large hopefully it fits him because they didn't have mediums they had larges extra larges and like smalls and he's for sure not a small but if anything it'll just be a little big on him he definitely won't be too small so that's good i'm so excited to put it on him and wait till Keiko gets home though it even has little legs on it it's so cute so cute with a little what's it called um long johns some long johns for Keone. And then tomorrow, I'm so excited because I'm going to go get breakfast with um, my friend from high school. She actually just had a little baby boy. So I'm gonna meet him and see her because I haven't seen her probably since I graduated two years ago. Um, she's a grade younger than me. So, seen her in a long time. So I'm really excited. 
to catch up with her and so she can just update me on everything she's been going through so I can meet baby. And I'm so excited, but that's tomorrow morning. That's tomorrow morning, so we have to wait for that. But yeah, I'm gonna chill, wait till he gets home, and then I'll update you once we put this sweater on him. Look, it's too big on him. Look how cute. You want a treat? Let's get a treat, come on. Let's get a treat. Yeah. Get a treat. <laughs> it's a large, he needs a medium. So we're gonna go switch it out. Good morning, guys. Today is Sunday, 9.27, and I'm at Panera now, about to meet Caitlin here. Just waiting for her, though, and I'm really excited. It wasn't supposed to rain yet today, but it's already sprinkling, kind of, so that's kind of sad, but it's, it's all good. It is what it is. But yeah, I'm really excited to eat, really excited to see them, and yeah. Hello. I'm with Caitlyn. Hi. I don't know where to look, sorry. I look <laughs> there all the time. Yeah. Should look Ooh. there, though. This is Caitlyn. Hi. <laughs> you want to say anything yeah. about yourself? Um, I'm Caitlyn. I'm a teen mom. Uh, this is my baby. Ooh. Kaleo. Beautiful little boy. He's so cranky. Say hi. <laughs> say hi. Such a happy baby. <laughs> look at all that hair. Yeah. Oh, no. You're going to cry. You're fine. He's okay. He doesn't like he his car seat. But yeah. Um, uh huh. She just started a channel. Yeah. I'll link it in the description. Yeah. We're the we Douglas family. Mm hmm. So cute. Thank you. We just got Panera. <laughs> I literally yeah. forgot to film everything in there. <laughs> but we just talked for a long time. We got it some really oatmeal fun. and we some did. green smoothies. Mm -hmm. It was good. They were good. Yep. Dairy free. Yeah, I know I have to be dairy free. It mm -hmm. sucks. But it's mom fine. life. For the baby. <laughs> I know. <laughs> but it was good seeing you. Yeah, I know it was good seeing you too. So good seeing you. <laughs> I just like kiss your cheek. I know. <laughs> oh. oh my oh gosh. My God. Oh. Say bye, Kaleo. Say bye. Bye, baby. See you later. Mm-hmm. Alright, hold on. 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 Hold on